Holidays, well, they're approaching faster and faster. Absolutely. Families will be gathering around the holiday table in just over two weeks for Thanksgiving. That is fast. I know, right around the corner. Mm. But before all that, the state has a message urging all residents to roll up their sleeves and get vaccinated before the holiday season. Coughing, sniffling, and sneezing, often signs of the season. As the weather gets colder, people stay inside and gather together, creating a perfect environment for respiratory viruses to spread. But taking action now could give you and your loved ones protection before getting together for the holidays. That's why the state is urging residents to get vaccinated now. Local hospitals are starting to see a rise in cases and admissions, particularly for RSV and their expecting flu and COVID to be close behind. I know that the admissions for RSV to base state uh, have increased uh, uh, significantly in the last couple of weeks, which is, this is the norm. This is what we've seen every winter. Dr. John Kelly with Redwood Pediatrics tells Western Mass News the only winter without RSV or the flu was 2020-2021 during the pandemic when people were isolated and wearing masks. The State Department of Public Health says everyone six months and older should get a seasonal flu vaccine and an updated COVID-19 vaccine, both of which can take up to two weeks to take full effect to protect against infection, serious illness and hospitalization, and reduce the chances of suffering and the effects of long COVID. Many people are also eligible for RSV vaccinations this year, including pregnant people, newborns, and many people 60 years and older. However, not all insurance companies are covering the cost of this one, but it may be worth it regardless. If I was high risk, if I had, you know, COPD or bad asthma uh, or some other serious illness, I, I'd, I'd pay out of pocket for the RSV. Personally. Officials say COVID-19, flu, and RSV are three viruses that are most likely to cause severe disease resulting in hospitalization and sometimes death. For infants, the RSV vaccine is recommended for all infants younger than eight months, but the manufacturer is struggling to keep up with demand, currently working through a backlog. Dr. Kelly tells Western Mass News when the vaccine does become regularly available, it's going to be a game changer, as one of the most common reasons children under one are admitted to the hospital is because of RSV. When it got approved, the studies showed that it decreased hospitalization by 80%. That's huge. While the holidays are a time for gathering, public health officials say if you're not feeling well, you should stay home, get tested, and if the test is positive for flu or COVID-19, get treatment to prevent the spread of illness. Officials add putting vaccinations on your holiday to-do list may be one of the best gifts you can give yourself and the people you gather with. And while it's never too late, it's better to get ahead of the holiday season and peak respiratory disease season.